John the Baptist appears golden verse, and with many other words John exhorted the people and proclaimed the good news to them, Luke 3 18 Bible text, Luke 3 to 2 6, 15 18 2 During the high priesthood of Annas and Cephas, the word of God came to John son of Zechariah in the wilderness, 3 He went into all the country around the Jordan, preaching a baptism of repentance for the forgiveness of sins. For as it is written in the book of the words of Isaiah the prophet, a voice of one calling in the wilderness, a prepare the way for the Lord, make straight paths for him. 5 Every valley shall be filled in, every mountain and hill made low, the crooked roads shall become straight, the rough ways smooth. 6 And all people will see God's salvation. 15 The people were waiting expectantly and were all wondering in their hearts if John might possibly be the Messiah. 16 John answered them all, I baptize you with a water. But one who is more powerful than I will come, the straps of whose sandals I am not worthy to untie. He will baptize you with be the Holy Spirit and fire. 17 His winnowing fork is in his hand to clear his threshing floor and to gather the wheat into his barn, but he will burn up the chaff with unquenchable fire. 18 And with many other words John exhorted the people and proclaimed the good news to them. Less names to explore the reasons John the Baptist was born or appear in the scene message John the Baptist was born about 5 BC and now about 26 AD about the age of 30 he appears in the wilderness of Judea. When he was born on earth his mandate was to preach to everyone that they should repent and turn from wickedness and prepare themselves for the coming of the Messiah. His message was a cry for repentance that the time was at hand for people to prepare for the coming of the king. John had a very special calling as the messenger of the Messiah. He was given understanding by God about the Messiah, and he knew something that most people didn't understand, that the Holy Spirit would be given to all who believe, and their bodies would become the new temple of God. Malachi 3 to 1 Behold, I will send my messenger, and he shall prepare the way before me, and the Lord, whom ye seek, shall suddenly come to his temple, even the messenger of the covenant, whom ye delight in, behold, he shall come, saith the Lord of hosts. John appeared with his message involving exhortation, strong encouragement and passionate advice. He was certainly not afraid to speak his mind. He was bold and outspoken. He appeared to preach repentance from sin. The appearance of John the Baptist was to fulfill his mission of proclaiming kingdom message of repentance and the appointed time of long-awaited Messiah. Every appearance of legends in the past is corroborated with a mission in God's saving agenda. John had nothing whatsoever to do with the kingdom of this world and the worldly pleasures around him. His only focus was on the kingdom of heaven and the very king who was about to appear. He had nothing to do with wealth or eloquent soft clothing or elaborate meals. His food was the food of the poorest in the land. He ate locusts which were gathered in the desert, and wild honey which was scooped out of the hollow part of trees. He never cut his hair and never drank wine. Water was only drink. He was completely devoted to his task. The people came from all around to hear John's message, confess their sins and get baptized. The Bible says they came from Jerusalem, Judea, and the region of the Jordan. Any appearance without gospel relevance has no profit for eternity. Your appearance on earth must proclaim God's glory to guarantee you for eternity with Christ Jesus. Matthew 10, 32-33 Conclusion The appearance of John the Baptist is to remind you that you have a mission. As John preached repentance, so did the Lord expects you to do. You should prepare the world for the second coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. John lived to fulfill his mandate, so must live to fulfill your own purpose on earth.
your daily appearance must proclaim the gospel to guarantee your eternity. You have responsibility to change and impact your world positively. Prayer Lord empower me to impact my world and make better than I met it in Jesus name. Amen.